Hey, good morning. It's Wednesday. Listen, today is a great day to be alive. When I think about all the stories in the Bible, right, where God breathed life into Sarah's womb, which was barren, right? And an old body. Come on. When he breathed life into the dry bones and caused it to form, when he brought Lazarus out of the grave. Come on, y'all. Listen, we serve a great God. We serve a God that brings dead things to life and speaketh those things is not as though they are. So I want to encourage you on today. Those areas that are dry, let's allow God to send the rain to nourish those places. For those that are, feel like they're lonely, right? Listen, you are not alone. God is a present help in the time of trouble. He says he is our strength and he is our refuge. If you call his name out, he said in his word, by his name, he is a strong tower that the righteous run into it and they are saved, right? We serve an alive God. We have a live God. Yes, our God is alive and he is alive inside of us. For those that might feel hopeless, let me encourage you. There are going to be some times where, man, we've gone through grief. We've gone through uh, being abandoned, rejected, being wounded by so many different things going on in our life, right? Dealing with crisis and adversity. But just know that if you are alive right now, you still have a purpose. And guess what? God thinks about you. His plans, his thoughts, they're of good for you. That's how he thinks. He wants to give you a future. He wants to give you an expected end and he wants to give you hope. So I pray today that the dry areas will become nourished. Those dark places will become light. Those dead places will become alive on today. We serve a God that is so much alive. And guess what? He wants to bring life into your body today. So have a wonderful day. It's Wednesday and let's live.